Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Once again, help me to search for the best of the notification bell for more updates to come. And in today's video, I'm going to give you another opportunity to hear from the beloved wife of Pastor Keon Hudson and listen to what well, the reason why uh, she had to do this live video on Instagram. One thing that made me happy and excited is because she said that. Because she looks beautiful and she really looks so pretty. Oh, hey, and an amazing Pina. thing as she also was with her daughters on this life. It was kind of very, very good. You were supposed to say hi. To that life. So let's get into the video and get to listen to what hey. and every little thing that she now. talked about. Why are you doing a, uh, a live at 9 o'clock? I don't know. I just felt like I look cute today. <laughs> you know? I don't know why I have these with these. So you what do you guys have going on? You got live because you look cute? Mm-hmm. Okay. What's going on, guys? Hi, Michelle. Michelle said hi, brother. Should I show you your shoes? I have on Crocs. They're yeah, fine. They definitely don't match your outfit. It does not match my outfit. Um, Michelle, he said hello. Hey, hey y'all, hey y'all. How you doing? I really don't have a reason to be on live. I just wanted to say hi. And they say I never go live, which I really don't. So I'm on here now. Hey, Leslie. Um, hey, Quinn. Uh, so, yeah, I guess, I don't know, what are we going to talk about, guys? It's probably some good stuff. Um, please come host a conference in Charlotte. Okay, I'll come host a conference in Charlotte. Um, I don't know if my niece is on here occasion, but she sent me this today. My tough crowd, Drew League, you gotta be from LA. Well, maybe you don't have to be from LA to know what Drew League is, but it's 50th anniversary and they did a compilation with tough crowd, so. Super cute and um, repping. Um, Quinn, I got an invite, I'm about to, okay. All right, you know we have anything for you, Quinn, so it's all good. Um. I want to come in. I am coming to, to New York um, what am, in a couple of weeks, I think. My daughter is planning something. And so I, I will be in New York. Um, where can you purchase Tough Crowd? I think it's toughcrowd.com. Um, Brandon Jennings clothing line. Uh, your son plays in the Drew. I used to have a Drew League team when I was in LA full time. It was, it was work. It was a lot of work. Um, new shows coming out. Well, there's a new, um, somebody asking for Pastor to do a quick prayer. No, not right now. Anyway, um, there's a new Basketball Wives City, um, Orlando. We're adding Orlando to the franchise. And they're, you know, some young girls. They just got other stuff going on more a lot of stuff going on so um yeah that's tune in for that it'll premiere the same time as basketball wives at la which i believe is october 9th if i have that right um love the podcast thank you we are still um shooting the podcast we want to we want to debut it all where you can binge watch all the episodes and um, not, you know, just put out stuff one at a time. We actually are shooting again tomorrow and Thursday, I think, are our film days for this week. But we're almost done with our first um, season. <clears throat> so I will let you guys know because we are going to put out a season and not just put out separate episodes. Um, what's the most challenging thing about Basketball Wise brand is, oof, it's the people, the viewers, you know, like watching reality TV, people get super invested and they, and it's, it's great because, you know, you become a fan of the show and you watch, but I think they take everything very literal 
and it's such such a small part of our lives that um you know you really don't know us completely but it's easy to think you do so that's a little challenging but i think i've been doing it so long it's been 13 years i probably have some extra thick skin that not much bothers me about what people think um do i enjoy living in houston now i do i think that um i needed a break from i'm live just in case you come around here hey here we go um i do enjoy living in houston there she is hi how was your day um so what else houston is hot i'm just answering questions are y'all going to have bible study every week nope we're gonna probably do that once a month because you know it's a thing it's a thing why you act like you can't see you don't wear glasses stop it you don't even have to look at it like that michelle not. said your favorite she's your you're her favorite senior Hey. She's a senior, guys. It's my baby. It's my last one. You think I look like you? What am I do? What am I do if you leave? Um, cry. <laughs> Definitely gonna cry. You gonna cry? I might. Oh, if she don't cry, y'all. If she cry, it's over. Just pack me a bag, <laughs> and I'm going with you. If you cry, it's over. Oh, Lord. Oh, okay. Ready to see you at Purpose. Oh, me too. I'm ready for Purpose, her conference. I love the doctor. You hear me? That's my girl. I feel like she and I, we haven't had a chance to like hang out, hang out, but I can hang out with her. I can really hang out with her. She, she's, hey, CJ. She is so dope and just like super cool. You know, I just like, it's some church folks. Let me just be honest. It's some church folks I can hang with. It's some I can't. It's some I just have to because I'm in this circle now. And, um, but, yeah, it's some that's just like, I just want people to give who they really are. Let's just keep it real. Let's keep it 100. Don't, don't morph into somebody that you're not all of a sudden because you want, you know, views and likes. Don't, don't do that. Because who was you? last year this time you know what i mean i just feel like i i don't like that so and i'm a, as y'all can see gonna be me at all hi uh, memes i mean yeah, she said hi um but yeah i just i i gotta be me question. and mimi did yeah oh god she ain't gonna say nothing Let's see. My daughter wants to join. Let's see. Um, anyway, I, um, as I was saying, I just got to uh, um, remain being authentically me. And <laughs> hey, guys. Hi, me. What are you guys doing? <laughs> Nothing. Oh, oh. <laughs> you cute. We don't want to see your forehead, nor do we want to see right. your TV in the reflection. I need to get a window. cute little filter. Oh, you have to do your filter. Oh, oh, yes. <laughs> get into the camera, ma'am. I was just saying hello to you guys. Okay. You All right. My lashes. I did them myself. Oh, good job. Good job. Okay. Get. That's Put awesome. a battery in that uh fire thing, please. Where's Hello. Okay. <laughs> He's right here. Show show Murphy. I mean, show the people Murphy. Murphy. This is her dog. You need to hear. Oh, oh my! See how horrible <laughs> of a dog. <laughs> Goodbye. 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 You making me look bad. You making me look crazy. Cut his bang. He has one tomorrow. He can't even see. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me do it again. Mark. Uh-uh. Okay. Uh, hi, Mark. Girl, I'm hanging up on you because that battery, you need to put a battery in here. 
I don't even hear it. Goodbye. <laughs> I love you. Bye. I love you guys. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye. How do I hang her up? I can do it. Oh, you got to hang up. Um, she looks like her grandmother. Um, yeah, so that's, don't, I need that. Well, you need that. You can open it. Um, anyway, y'all, as I was saying, I think that everybody should authentically be themselves. You know, I think that I, I, um, how do I, I'm trying to say it where I don't offend anybody. Um, it's one of those things where I have met several people over the past couple years and I, and I meet them. I, I met them. Sorry. I don't know what that was, but I met them one way. And then I guess it became okay to now, I don't know. I, I don't, you know what, let me shut up. Cause I'm probably gonna offend somebody and I don't wanna do that. So um, people behind, people hide behind the cloth. I'm not talking about the church folks. I just really would just like them to be real, you know? Cause it's a lot of fraudulent going on especially on the uh on the ground it's a lot, a lot of fraudulent going on this right here is what is that like why is this that's bothering me i have like what is that called cap <laughs> that's so ugly anyway um you said maybe they just fan out. No, I mean, I don't, no, it's not fan out. It's more like um, mimic. That's nice, right? Patrice, am I out of line? Enough. Okay. Enough. All right. I've been wrangled. Anyway, um, <laughs> let's just say, come on, authenticity. That's what it is. Be authentic. If you're corny, just be corny. You know? If that's what it is, if you don't have no ideas, then remain bland. Own it. I, I need help. Because I don't have... Okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. Own it. Whatever it is. Anyway. Um, they're just not being there. Either. Yeah, that's true. I'm just saying. Will, <laughs> I'm just saying. Be what it is. Okay, well, I'm a, I'm reeling it. I'm reeling it. <laughs> Robin, remain bland if that's what you want. You know, if you blah, own your blindness. I will appreciate your blindness. Remain, not remain blank. It is. If you're typical, own your typical. You can't wear not. You can't wear the not part. Just typical. Own it. It's okay. Because maybe that's just who you are. Maybe that's how God made you. Maybe He made you typical. Own it. No seasoning, no nothing, just bleh. <laughs> What'd you say? I don't think I need a light. You think I need a light? <laughs> Chewy! Good so, God. I'm already. Oh my goodness. See? Leslie, don't log out. Um, I'm, 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 I thank you so much. I appreciate you for that. Yeah. Um, this is not the one to change. Wait, what does it say? It's Jenna, you know, she's right. I'm not saying that. Um, <laughs> whoa, you know what I'm saying? You can't wear the not, not the typical, just typical. Cross it out. Okay, thanks, Miyadi. Um, we needed that. 
We needed that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Somebody said we needed that. Good job. Um, anyway, so enough about that. Moving on, because I'll put myself on punishment. Um, um, what else is going on out there, guys? <laughs> um, all campus have membership is a pillar of our women. Wait, I don't know what you're talking about, Pastor Hammond. What you saying? The campus is we have membership pillar. Oh, I missed it. Maybe I'm late. Okay. What, what would we do without these genius kids? I don't know. Because she does everything. Am I going to Beyonce? I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it because um, that weekend my daughter has a college visit. And I'm trying. This is her senior year. And I'm trying to um, be at, be very present. I don't want to miss um, I don't want to miss anything for her senior year for sure. Women evolve. I'm supposed to. I don't know if I'll be there the entire weekend, but I will be at, at least one of the days. She has a, a college visit that weekend too. We are loaded for the month of September with college visits, so. Um, yeah, I'm trying to start my own wig brand. I don't even wear wigs. I'm a sewing girl. No shade to wigs. I just don't wear wigs because I, I, I don't like looking at that at the at the thing. The what is that? The net maybe. I don't in, to myself. Like I would be looking at it in the mirror. I don't. I can't. Um, and I know they have great wigs. I know y'all gonna say there's great wigs, and there are. Me personally, I still see the net. I don't like it. Okay. Um, so yeah, I get my little sewing so y'all can see this ain't no net. But thus, I do have this, so I don't know what's best. Um, yeah. And I want my edges. You know, you hear like the horror stories of the it, like when they take it off. A closure, no, a closure might as well have a wig because they that's the net too. I can't do, I can't. And I just need to touch my scalp at least in a spot or two. I probably have like full anxiety if I can't. It ain't for me. It's just me though because there are some beautiful wigs. It's just me. Um. But yeah, that's just y'all ignore me and my issues. You part wig, well, maybe is that the same kind of sewing ish? I don't know. Um, what else? What else? What else? Robin, <laughs> I uh, what about your basketball live show? They'll be out uh, October 9th. Uh, Basketball Wives LA and Basketball Wives Orlando. So that is, yeah, I believe it's October 9th, whatever that Monday is. Um, oh, y'all back on this this wig. I'm just saying, y'all, it's me. I, I don't, it is no shade to wigs. Wig on. I just, it's just not for me. Um, what are you using to keep your hair mess from the, oof. A sewing, you know that stuff. I don't really have to do much to it, um, and I just try, try to stay out the heat. Honestly, I go from the car to the uh, air conditioning. How do you balance it all? Honestly, I don't really believe in balancing it all. I just think managing it is, because balance means I'm able to literally balance it and I don't think I do I think I try to choose my priorities wisely and intentionally depending on what else is going on so what's important changes and changes often because life changes every day right so I do more prioritizing than balancing somebody said how does your body adjust to Texas versus LA Ooh, yeah. 
Well, you know, now LA got all these weather issues. I mean, it ain't getting 110 with this kind of humidity, but they got earthquakes and and hurricanes at the same time. That is that's unheard of. Like growing up, I, that's just unheard of. Um, a show that Pastor and I watched together. Um, we watch Lincoln Lawyer together. We watch, believe it or not, we are naked and afraid bingers because we like to think we can do it. Even though we both know we never would make it 24 hours naked in the woods. Um, but for some reason, we think we can when we watch it. You know, it just... Do you plan on having a child together? We do not. We got enough together. Six is enough. Um, so yeah, Naked and Afraid, what else we watch? Um, Your Honor, we finished that together. We, uh, we have a few shows that we watch together. I can't even think, oh, we're Yellowstone. We love Yellowstone. Um, yeah, we got a few. We got a few. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? Y'all love Naked and Afraid. It's so good. I really want to start a fire with the um, fire. I want the fire started. I don't want to do the sticks. I don't look, that doesn't look like, I, yeah, I probably don't have the patience for that. Give me a fire starter, though. I think I could do that. I think I could do it. Um... Have you watched, I don't know if that's really a show, so I'm not going to say it. Small towns, have you ever visited Wichita Falls, Texas? Bet you ain't been there. I actually, you want a fun fact? I was born in Wichita Falls, Texas. And my parents are from there originally. Um, pretty much my whole family is from there. My Well, my grandparents or not but anyway long story short my parents are born and raised Wichita Falls Texas I was born there and they moved immediately um I, I didn't even make one years old and we moved to California but technically I was born in Texas <clears throat> and that is a small city like separated by railroads I've only when I was a little girl we used to go back like for Christmas because my, my mom's siblings lived there my grandfather lived there and all that so we would go back for Christmas when I was young and then probably by the time I was on about 10 or so we stopped going as much and I've only been back as an adult once twice for two funerals and um, yeah that's different very very different so all I have to say about that uh, have you ever visited? Yes, I have visited uh, Virginia, cities in Virginia. Um, ooh, I'm not answering that one. Advice for Christian single women waiting for a husband. Hmm. Don't, don't wait. Like, live life. I think what's meant for you will come to you. So maybe, maybe the waiting is what I would say. Don't, don't just wait. Like, do, be free. What's, what's for you will come. Um, what do you think about the show, Your Honor? I thought it was good. I know it's slow. Second season, too slow. Disappointingly slow. First season, I was all in. Have you ever been to Buffalo? Nope, never been to Buffalo. Um, everybody else in the uh, chat got the answers apparently to <laughs> uh, do you still have your cannabis business I do not I do not is your son going to stay my son hasn't been at LSU in two years he's um, in the G League now so, yeah, he hasn't been at LSU. I don't watch The Shy. I heard that's good. I heard that's good. 
um, I gotta, but I, I gotta start at the beginning, right? It's not one of them shows you're gonna jump in now. You gotta start at the beginning to understand it. Am I coming to Orlando soon? Yes, I think my husband and I are in Orlando next weekend. He's speaking somewhere and um, I'll be there with him. So, yes, I remember Kim who made the cookies. I saw that. Um, do you mentor? Honestly, I get asked that question a lot. And although I really would love to, I don't think I have the capacity to do it the way it should be done. Because I do believe that, um, is Peanut Interacting up? I'm, I'm, let, me, let me pay attention. But um, I do think that being a mentor, you need to be intentional. You need to be focused. You need to um, put in the time. And I know right now life is just busy. So I wouldn't do that to somebody. You know, I wouldn't want to half it. I want to say something else, but. You know what I mean. Do you travel with your husband all the time? Not all the time. When our schedules can, I, I definitely do. Um, I try to. We try to travel with each other. You know, like. If um, you're too big, just bring a chair. Come on. Okay. I hope somebody takes a picture and posts this because you are doing too much. Have any favorite restaurants? Oh. And yep, your phone's ringing. Go on now. Somebody probably see you and is calling. Oh, God. oh, don't rush. Listen, do they ever grow up? Ever, 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 ever. Um. So how tall, Miara, how tall are you? Six, four, six, four. Um, do, she's back. What's my workout routine? I don't have, I don't have You need to mind your business. I do need one, but I don't have one. I really hate working out really, really bad. Like, I'm gonna do better though, y'all. I'm ready to come back to Nashville. I really liked Nashville. Hi, Terry. Ow. Do not, you better not say it. I am so athletic. Guys, she thinks she's athletic. I am. I so am. Yeah, you can do a cardio. But other than that, I can do other things. She needs a little bit of work. <laughs> what else? What else am I supposed to do? The shop to go. Okay, maybe I don't play basketball, but I do other things. Like, I'm great at kickball. Everyone. Everyone cannot kick ball. Everybody cannot coordinate Everyone their length above the ball age on time. Of Eleven. Can kick ball. Not even. Eight. Everybody cannot play kickball that good. So you can kick the ball up. Have and I tried cycling? Ball. I have. I really have. I think I've tried everything. Have y'all done that cycling where you dance? It's like a hip hop. You see how they call me names? Yeah, that's whatever. Um, yeah, I tried cycling and it still hurts. What's my skin routine? Um, I don't really, I mean, I think I just use the same, I'm, I'm a, I use the same product. Actually, my husband just bought this uh, facial wash for me. It's called Oxygen Wash. I've been using it for about a week. I love it. It like leaves your skin like with a glow. I'll get the name of it. Um, the y'all give me some good TV shows that um, Kiana and I can watch. We 
um, sent the picture in your messages. It's adorable. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I got to see what Peanut's saying. What are you talking about? Do you apply your own makeup? Normally, yes. Today, no, because I had some pictures to take um, earlier. So, color, what's her it Instagram? Color by DeJour. Color by DeJour. Her name is Elena. She does my makeup. Does a great job. Um, the Wiz. Mm. Twain. Twain. So, believe it or not, brother, your brother tells me at like 11 o'clock the other night, okay, let's watch The Wiz. I can't watch The Wiz at 11 o'clock at night. I just, I need to, I need, it needs to be in the daytime where I can be up singing the songs. Not 11 when I'm laying in the bed. It ain't that kind of, it ain't that kind of movie. So then he was like, see, why not try to watch it? Oh, Bear on Hulu. I tried to watch Bear on Hulu. I was, is it slow? Because I'm trying to get into it. My son told me that that was good, but I just, it was moving a little slow. Maybe I need to give it a little time. Um, We have pretty white teeth. Thanks. You do? First time. You get a kid Invisalign, they don't use it. My teeth were already straight. Okay. Um, Bear was good. Okay, let me go back and try. Will I ever go back to short hair? Probably not. I don't think so. Hey, fam. Hey, Sid. Um, yeah, yeah, probably not. We watched Lincoln Lawyer. Killed it. Knocked that out. I got a little invested. Who is Aaron Carter? Did we watch that? No. You're done? Oh, okay. All right. Your butt's in the camera. All right. Did you say bye to the people? All right. Salute. Thank you for your services. Ter Uncle Terry said hello. Hi. <laughs> she is 17, going on 25. Pretty much. Pretty much. <clears throat> um, Lady Sings the Blues. That was a great movie but again that's one of them movies you can't watch at night you're gonna be i need to sing i gotta sing with it you know what i mean and if i can't do that we gotta watch it in the daytime when i can sing and perform let me tell you my brother-in-law is in this in the comments i just would like to what's happening i just would like to share this story with you guys so i don't know how many weeks it's been probably um two months maybe i think he was in the hospital and i need to share all his business it's, it's out there but he was in the hospital right and it was very serious and me although i can get very, very serious even in my seriousness i'm probably a little inappropriately gonna say something that's funny um or funny to me at least. So anyway, Terry's in the in in ICU, right? And it's maybe a week in to him being in ICU. And clearly he's of course not in a great mood, right? And um I'm sure, sure doesn't want to be bothered. Although on the inside I know he was internally happy and grateful to see our faces. But here we are you're not feeling good and you're still you know trying to make somebody talk and be like eh. so i offered to perform a full dance routine like a choreographed dance routine including the nurses you know staff anybody who wanted to join in i was just trying to lift his spirits because he needed it right so i said terry i said brother we love you so much. We want you to get out of here. This place is just sad and depressing, you know? So I said, I can get the nurses together. We can do a whole routine. We got a few days, we're gonna be here. 
We're going to be practicing out in the hallway. Give it like a good five, six, seven, eight, several times in a row. Confetti, balloons, the whole nine, right? This man said, <clears throat> I said, doesn't that sound good? He was like, no. I said, sir, when does it ne ever not sound good to have a full choreographed five, six, seven, eight from me and staff of the hospital? Like, seriously? So I'm continuing. I'm like, listen, it's going to be so good. Like, bells and whistles. Do you hear me? So he's like, no, I don't. I don't want it. And never cracked a smile. No, I don't want it. Can I tell you to this day, right now, I want to say I am offended. Do you understand how good that 5678 was about to be? Like, I had a whole medley in my head of songs that we could possibly do the 5678 to. And it was not just five, six, seven, eight. It was like, you know what I'm saying? That was, that's how you started. Five, six, seven, you know. And it was going to go into our whole, our whole thing. That man said no. With a straight face. Borderline attitude. So, I just want to tell the world, Terry Wayne Brooks, my brother-in-law, shut down. An epic performance. The outer world will never see. It was a one time, one time thing. I had the nurses in and everything. They were like, yes, yes, let's do that. I said, we could go around to all the patients. The other patients, you know, we could spread the love. Let's make it a thing. Let's let's make these people feel better, at least for a moment. Terry Wayne Brooks killed it. Killed. Everybody else's joy. He didn't want the joy right there. But that didn't mean he had to kill it for everybody else. Sharon, somebody said Sharon Ann would have helped. Sure would have. Emmy Award winning dance. You hear me, Robin? You already know. You already know. I'm just saying. I just needed to say that. So Terry Wayne Brooks, I just want you to know that you probably maybe could have been out the hospital a day or two earlier if you had let me share that joy, that joyful, joyful moment with you. I just want you to know. That's it. That's it and that's all. I would, oh, I would have recorded it. Somebody said I should have recorded it. I, <laughs> best belief it would have been recorded. All right, that's all. I just need to share that and tell y'all how Terry Rain, Terry Rain just denied my expressions of love in his sick room. It's all good. It's all good. Anywho, um, it's been fun talking to y'all. I'm just rambling. Um... I love you, Mo. Do you want to go live with me and say hi to the people? Peanut will be so mad. Um, anywho, what else? You should go ahead and do the dance. Mm, nope. See, I can't do the dance now. I can't do the dance now. It's not the same. It was on my heart in that moment for Terry Rain Brooks because I saw how, how down he was in that moment. And I said, I just was like, I felt so cool, y'all. I said, oh, this man, did he say no? You know, okay. Um, what else? What else? What else? Are you prepared for? for ooh, I don't preach. This is me preaching. <laughs> what you mean? This is my sermon. You missed it. It was in the beginning. It was called. It was talking about authenticity and how you should be yourself. You know? You want me to say it one more time? All I said was if you're corny, own your corn. You know what I mean? If you're bland, own your blandness. No seasoning, no creativity, own it! Get a team that can help you with that. 
area. But don't don't try to act like it is something that is not. That's all. That was my sermon for today. Besides that, that's it, y'all. I'm done acting up. And um, I love y'all. I will try to do this a little more often. Let me see if my honey dip will come say bye. Babe! Babe! He's trying to act like he don't hear me. Babe! Yeah. You want to come say bye to the people? I am screaming your name because you weren't listening. I said, babe! You didn't hear me? I heard you. I thought you called me. Calling them babe? No, I'm calling you babe. I, babe. I told my story about Terry not letting me dance. What story is that? The one he didn't let me dance in the ICU when I offered my 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 joy for him to feel better. Remember? And he said no. All these people been sitting on here with you for. We having a good time, can't you tell? Mm -hmm. Miara came. Mimi was here. Mimi. Yeah. She did. brought her in. I did. Was she uh was she okay? Hey Amaris. She's fine. Hey Jay Bolin, he's here. Did Jay say, Bolin. Yeah. What's up, Jay? Yeah, your brother was Hey here. Monique. I was trying to tell them how he didn't receive my gift of dance. Well, um he probably didn't know who you were at the time. And, That's um, what it was. Yeah. Because if he had known, it just would have been a no break. I'm saying. He had been through a lot. So you You're right. Yeah. You're right. Terry Wayne was. was well, I'll tell you what. Do not. Let's do it now. Going. Let's do it. I mean, since you're in such <laughs> great spirits, it's and not the same. It's, it's definitely the same. It's I mean, these same. people deserve it. So let's do it. It's not the same. It's not on my heart like it was. <laughs> I don't have my nurses in the, in the staff of the hospital behind yeah. me. So next time, y'all, next time. I'll have the dance, maybe. Mm. Come back to DC. We coming to see you. Love y'all. Love y'all. Bye. I don't know how to leave here, babe. Okay. <laughs> Just stay off the internet. <laughs>